All right, good morning and welcome back to day 70, um, I, 77, 78, day 78, I believe. Um, right now it is 7 a.m. I had to wake up at 6.30 a.m. to prepare a call at 7 a.m. But then I realized that I scheduled the call incorrectly. It's actually tomorrow, not today, because there's a time zone difference between he and in the USA. And um, I made a mistake, but yeah, I made a mistake. So anyways, I'm up. I got maybe six hours of sleep, six, six and a half. So that's good in my opinion, because I've been suffering with insomnia. But I also weighed myself this morning and I was 56.7 kilos. You know what, let's weigh ourselves here. Let's go here, boom. 56.2 kilos and yeah so now now um because it's day 78 there's only like two there's only 12 days left to go and really my focus um my focus is to to tighten out that diet and just make sure i see it through i've been trying to do volume eating so volume eating is where you just have a bunch of low calorie foods that just confuse your brain to think you're eating a lot um but i think that the challenge is really sleep i think sleep is definitely the hardest out of all three of them between sleep working out and diet sleep is about the the most challenging that i struggle with and it's probably the most it's it's arguably the most important because if you can't if you don't sleep properly you don't recover and if you don't recover you can't really train that well etc but um but yeah uh you may notice that i'm also filming these videos in landscape not vertical so i hope you guys like that and i'll take you through my day and i'll see you around peace all right guys back from training um normally after training i'll go and do a leg day as you guys will know a light leg day but um i can tell i don't have the energy maybe because i haven't been sleeping well so i'm going to go home just refuel do a bit of work and then i'm going to come back to the gym and just do a super light day you know i'm I, I plan to do squats which i haven't done barbell squats not smith machine then deadlifts then um leg press then um then uh, Romanian deadlifts and I'm going to superset all of them with uh, goblet squats and I'm just going to keep it very light but still challenging so I'll see you at the gym. Alright so I'm at the gym and I definitely did not do what I say I was going to do. Uh, I pretty much did everything but I did not superset it with a goblet squat. I was a bit tired and now looking back at this footage it makes sense you know I literally had six hours of sleep so there we go. Oh did I? Actually I don't remember if I said I had 6 hours of sleep But I definitely do not feel it So right now you can see there's 20 kilos on each side of this leg press machine This was a pain in the ass With just even 20 kilos on each side you know Like I don't know what's wrong with me Definitely did not feel my strength right I just I kept pushing through But I definitely did not go heavy You can see with these back squats it's just 5 kilos on each side Normally the highest I'll go is 20 kilos plus 15 kilos on each side Did some sumo deadlifts This was pretty cool so 60 kilos and then I think I moved it up to 90 kilos sumo deadlift, but I did not feel it. So I, there's no, there's no even point even trying to go heavy. There's no point. All right. All right, guys, just came back from the gym. Didn't really feel like going, but you know, I did it anyway. It's just super, super light leg day. <laughs> even put like, even the leg press when I first started with 20 kilos on each side, like I was already dead, you know? So anyways, I was craving ice cream. So I got this, usually I get Halo Top, but there's a competitor version, 28 grams of protein, this whole tub and only apparently 300 calories in this whole tub as well. So I'm looking forward to eat that and I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna chill and rest because tomorrow, if all goes accordingly, I'm going to play tennis with one of my mates and then we're gonna do sparring towards the end of the day. So really, really need to focus on recovery. Peace. And also, so one more thing, um, I've reached 12,659 steps as well. Uh, the past couple of days, I might've been slacking off and then towards the end of the night, I had to like walk on my in-home treadmill, but now that I've done it, it's time to rest. And resting I did. So end of the day with 12,390 steps and I'll see you guys tomorrow.